All right, let, let's go meet our first yes, guest. Let's go. Come on. All Good right. Times. We have Brooke Tuggle and Chelsea Powers from Tuggle's Gifts and Goods. They're here to tell us about some of their fun upcoming pop ups yeah. that you can check out. Hi, ladies. How are you doing? Hello. Good Great. To have how are you? you? Here. We love Tuggles, and we know a lot of our viewers do too. What's new? What's going yeah. on? Well, I do. It is so fun. We carry so many of the people that have been on Indie Now, or like when I've told someone, oh, we're going to be on this, they're like, oh, I was just on it. So you guys do such a fun job of Thank like, you. Yeah, yeah, including tons of people in the neighborhood. We so love local. Yeah, yeah, we love it. Well, one of the biggest things that's happened since we were on your show like about a year and a half ago is we moved locations just literally across the street, still in Fountain Square. Okay. Just our space is now like four times larger, which Ooh. now means we can host like events and workshops and pop ups. That's and, fantastic. Uh, one of yeah, that's one of our like new favorite things that we're getting to do. So we wanted to kind of share about that, but otherwise nothing's changed. Like we still sell tons and hundreds of products um, that are like locally made. Yeah. Um, a lot of them artists that live directly in Fountain Square. For example, named Including Chelsea. I am yeah. one of them. Yeah. <laughs> she works for us and is an artist that sells in our store. Yes. And um, it's a great store to be in. <laughs> we have so many uh, local artists. It's and I've gotten to meet so many makers that's just made the process of getting into that so much easier, so much yeah. more fun. It's like become a community, yeah. it feels like, in a lot of ways. Yeah. That's great. That's Congrats really cool. on the new space. That's really yeah. exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Four times the size. Yes. What did you bring with you today? <laughs> we brought a little bit of everything. We tried to bring things that we did not bring last time, so some newer makers. Okay. Um, we have some soaps that um, Salt and Ash, um, who's actually a little store across the street, mm -hmm. um, she designed, or she made the soaps that are like neighborhood specific. We have a Garfield Park one too that's sold out because everyone in Garfield Park wanted yeah. that one. <laughs> um, but there's like Fletcher Place in Fountain Square. There's some jewelry. Do you want to share about some of the other things yeah. there? Yes, we have another local artist in front, Savannah Jacobs. We have her um, homemade coloring book. Okay, right and, here. Yes, <clears throat> and colored pencils, and then Tuggles timber pieces. We have hundreds of sizes in the store. <laughs> they cover the walls. It's gorgeous. Beautiful. It's awesome. Um, then what the soap's sitting on? We have a new local ceramics artist. Okay. Um, she, Mimeo. Yes. Her. Mimeo. Mimeo. Like Mimeo. M, M I M E O. Okay. Yes. <laughs> yes. And that's the olive oil pour that she made Ooh, to it. Yeah. They're amazing. Yes. A bunch of different that colors. That is beautiful. Of that. Love some good olive yeah. oil. Um, and too. Chelsea, what did you create? Because you've got some of your art I as do. well. In the store. Yes. Yeah. This is my uh, flyover print that I sell in the store. I do a lot of custom paintings, house portraits, pet portraits. Um, but I'm finally getting into kind of painting your favorite things about Indianapolis. Cool. Gonna, so stay tuned for that. That's going to be exciting. <laughs> that is beautiful. Look yeah. at that. Thank that you. Is working. When did you do this, Chelsea? That's awesome. When did I do it? Yeah. Um, about a year ago. Okay. I had someone commission it, and I said, you know what? I need to do more of these things. Krista, Amazing. how long would it take you to do that? Uh, you know what? It would take me well over the year that it's been since she yeah. made it, and it still wouldn't look like that. No, that's so, not true. Yeah. <laughs> Her paintings are amazing. She's very talented. So, so fun yes. pop-ups, great locally made uh, art and gifts, and you guys have a discount for people who come in and mention Indie Now, yeah. right? Yes, so if you come in anytime this week, like between now and next Thursday, um, just say you saw us on Indie Now and you'll get 10% off. Um, yeah. Thanks for offering that. Yeah, awesome. and you can always shop yes. online too at TugglesGiftsAndGoods.com, <laughs> but make sure you go in and check out their new spot in Fountain Square. Yes, and if you go to TugglesGiftsAndGoods.com slash events, that's where you can see the list of all of the upcoming events and pop-ups and we kind of keep it up to date so okay wow. yeah keep revisiting that's great yeah. well, thank you guys for being part of the show thank thanks you. for having us yeah. thank you well up next the traveling foodie guide will share three local restaurant options for takeout family dining and date night we love it when he's here he's got 55,000 almost 55,000 followers we're gonna break that today we'll be right back <laughs> with Marcus Stone y'all stick around <laughs>